And I laid my head down on the pillow, and for the very first time in my life, I saw a vision. The Lord just said, I know I was not sleeping, so I know it wasn't a dream. It was actually a vision. And I saw literally the map of the world, uh, like a flat map on the earth. And in the, in the vision, I saw literally pillars of fire coming down from heaven, connecting heaven to earth. And all over the earth, these pillars were coming down. And actually, the Holy Spirit just reminded me of this vision uh, today while I was here because I saw certain places on the map, and one of the places I saw was Australia. And in from these pillars of fire that were coming down, there were smaller pillars of fire shooting out to other locations. And the fire of God was dropping in many places all over the world. And there came a point, and as the Lord showed me this in 1993, so it's amazing. The Lord just brings this to my remembrance about 18 years later. And, and, and the Lord showed me Australia. I saw Australia on the map, and I saw a pillar of fire. Because most of the time when the pillars of fire came down, it touched a certain location. And then there would be, in some of them, it would shoot out to different locations and create a pillar of fire. But when I saw Australia, I saw literally a pillar of fire come down, and it was... Instant. It was an amazing thing, different than other places on the map. It was an instant thing that I saw, and that was the pillar of fire came down, and the whole entire continent, uh, the whole entire nation of Australia was instantly under the fire of God. It was an amazing thing, because other places it would come down and shoot out to other places, but this time the pillar came down, and it set the entire land ablaze. And the Holy Spirit just began to bring this to my remembrance here today. And I just believe that the pillar of the fire of God is coming down Amen. upon this nation. Amen. And it's coming down upon a people who are hungry and thirsty for Him. Amen. And I just believe that in this time, it was an instant thing. I believe and I declare today, tonight, that God is going to do a quick work. For the fires of revival are coming to the nation of Australia and God is going to begin to burn across this land for there have been certain things even in the weather and even with, with natural events that even have gone even to New Zealand that have happened in this area of the world that have shaken the land but the Lord says that I am preparing the hearts not only of the church but also of the unsaved in this nation, and they are going to see with their eyes the glory of the Lord. And I saw today, the Holy Spirit just showed me that there is going to be an event in somebody that's well known in this nation. I don't know if it's a politician or an athlete, but there's going to be an event, a tragedy that is going to take place. And it's going to get the attention, not of the church, but of the unsaved. Uh, and the Lord began to show this to me today and said that there's about to take place uh, an event that is about to shift this nation and prepare Australia for a mighty move of God. For there are going to be prophets, there are going to be worship, and, and I believe that the worship people in this room, this is a key moment because the songs that God is about to release in this nation, even through those of you that are here tonight, the songs that are going to be released are not going to be there to impress the masses, but they're going to bless the Lord. They're not going to be unto people, but they're going to be unto the Lord. And God says He's raising up a pure stream in Australia, and Australia is going to turn her face once again to the Lord, even with the very roots of this nation. God says right from the very beginning, this nation was consecrated to the Lord, and the Lord says, I'm going to bring her 
receive.